Oh, you love me. You really love me. You just missed my mom and dad. Oh, did they go down to the cafeteria? Oh, no. They didn't want to miss their first couples without children meeting. Here, Steve. I thought these would cheer you up. Gee, and I wanted to get such a beautiful bouquet of flowers. The room next door. The guy just croaked. <laughs> Uncle Steve, I got you a magazine. Astronomy Today. Oh, thanks, Richie. You're out of this world, little buddy. It was my idea. Yeah, but I took it out of the dumpster. <laughs> Yeah, but I held your feet. <laughs> well, hello, everybody. Uh, I'm Dr. Skiles. Hi, Doctor. Up, How are you doing? Mario Funziano. <laughs> Didn't he just croak? Yeah. Now his flowers are cheering me up. <laughs> Give it to me straight, Doc. I'm a man. I can take it. You got appendicitis. You better get some rest, because in a couple of hours, I'm going to take that appendix out. Oh, I see. Well, it's a standard procedure, and I don't foresee any problems at all. Well, thanks, Doc. And I have every confidence in you and your abilities. Ah, <laughs> uh, don't worry, Steve. You'll be back bugging us in no time. One can only hope. Now, if you'll excuse me, loved ones, I'd like to speak to Lara alone. Now, I know you're all reluctant to leave and oh, all of you. <laughs> What's on your mind, Steve? <laughs> Lara, I've loved you ever since I first laid eyes on you. Uh, Steve, I have a tennis court reserve, so if you <laughs> Honey Bunch, I may not make it through this medical ordeal. Would you please give me something to remember you by? Like what? Marry me. No. We get cakes. No. We go steady. No. A date. No. A kiss. On the hand. On the lips. The forehead. Deal. Steve. Uh, Lara? Yes? You're leaning on my appendix. <laughs> oh, 